Okay guys, I have the foundation on and I have also applied the rest of my face coming at you bald and lovely. <laughs> bonnet and look at the eyebrows. Look at it. Look at the bonnet. Oh, look at the light that came onto us. Mm. Mm. Okay guys, so after applying the foundation, at first I felt like, okay, it's kind of mm, greasy, but I don't know if that's because, you know, your girl is an oily skin girl, but applying the rest of my face on, I felt like, okay, this is not too bad, it applied well. I personally didn't see much of a difference using truffle on the inner center of my face and then using, I think, earth on my, the outer corners of my face. I felt like it was kind of, and in the end it ended up like blending the same, but you know, I don't know, maybe it'll look different on camera, so I went back over with my uh, contour powder on. I do have my CoverGirl Queen Collection contour powder on, so that's probably what's giving it this effect. But overall, you know, it applied well, it allowed the other products to apply well, so I'm just going to, you know, get my hair situation together, and we're going to be back, so just stay tuned for that. Like this. Then I bounce out Feeling great Feeling great Then this feeling you say Get your hair fixed And your nails done Put your hands up and Okay guys, following up on the other camera, I switched back to my vlogging camera, but I am wearing my foundation, the Anastasia Beverly Hills, and I went and finished applying the rest of the product on my face. It is basically 12 o'clock in the afternoon right now, so I'll come back at the end of the day and show you how the foundation is looking. I can't tell you that I'm not going to blot because I would normally blot with any foundation, so I may blot here or there, but you'll be able to see how it ended up sitting on my face and all that good stuff. So stay tuned for that. Okay, so it is about, I think it's about 5 p.m. It's about five hours since I put the makeup on and I have not blotted once and I have been outside playing, um, chasing the ice cream man. It's Mother's Day, so we've been doing a lot of outdoor activities and I have not blotted once. It's about 80 degrees today, which I think is like what? 
26, 27 degrees Celsius for those of you in the majority of the world. That's not America. <laughs> But um yeah, so it's a bit hot outside today and I think it's doing well. I I thought it would look much well, I have this indent here from when I wear my sunglasses, so don't mind that. I thought it would look much worse because you know sometimes like you feel like it's running, but it's actually not running that bad. So which is pretty good. Anyway, so I think I'm just gonna fix my nose area up. I'm gonna blot it. Um, I'm not wearing sunglasses anymore, so I'm gonna fix that indent. And it's starting to settle a bit into the creases of my face, but other than that, I think it's holding up pretty well for it having been five hours, and the past five hours I've been outside. So I'll come back again in the next four hours, and we'll see how it looks after a total of nine hour wear. All right, guys. Okay, it is about nine o'clock right now that there's no more natural light so i'm using my bedroom light and i just wanted you to show i wanted to show you how the foundation looks and actually for all intents purposes i think it looks pretty darn good like i only blotted earlier when you first saw me and surprisingly it's held up really really well i haven't really felt oily especially like here where i usually get oily i just feel kind of like my natural sheen coming through so on a scale of one to ten i probably for the first day of use i'd probably give this foundation like an eight but you know you have to wear a foundation a couple more times before you really see if it works for you but yeah i like this foundation so far so i probably continue to wear it but i think i'll return the cool portion because I, I don't think it really does anything for my skin. So, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. Don't forget to follow me on social media. My Instagram is FitBeautySusie and my Twitter is Miss Berhane. Talk to me and I will definitely talk back. As always, guys, I appreciate you and I look forward to watching you in the next one. Okay, bye. Jamatane.